All right, I'm getting a rematch against the Platinum player. I'm not going to pick Honda this time, by the way. Oh, let's see. Who should I pick against? I'm starting to pick weirdo versions of characters again, I would assume. Oh, let's see. Who's he going to pick? He's a big weirdo bison. Yeah, he picked bison. He fucking cheesed out with bison. Oh. Uh, <clears throat> I picked Super Turbo, so I can't do anything like that. I'll pick Balrog. I'll probably get outplayed by C.E. By bison, though, I would bet. He picked C.E. Bison, best character in the game, hands down. Nice. Wow, already. Already got me. Whoa, lag! Did you see the skip, the skip fucking frame, dude? Dude, I can't, I can't time anything because his connection sucks and it's skipping tons of frames of animation. So because of the netcode, I can't time anything against him. What? It showed me headbutting him and it took it back. I can't see. I can't do anything. The connection is so bad that he literally gets away with it. He just mashes punch in his laggy connection, and I can't time my move. Look at the look. <laughs> Did you see how laggy that was? Is it did, 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 did at the screen? I couldn't even do anything. Oh my god. Yo, this shit is so laggy, and this guy's fucking platinum rank, and he fucking has a terrible ass connection. I'm trying to think like what would beat that. What would beat that awful connection? I gotta really think hard here. Like, it's not gonna be ball rock because I can't ever throw. I won't be able to time anything. I basically gotta keep him around mid range. I'm gonna go for DJ. He did be hyper fighting Ryu. He did hyper fighting Ryu. That didn't make sense. Yeah, look at this, dude. I can't do anything. You saw how much animation it's skipping. How am I supposed to do anything when I can't see the attacks? I can't see the attacks. I'll never be able to stop it. Didn't do that. What the fuck? I can't see his attacks. It's skipping so many frames. I can never time anything. I'm just guessing and throwing Hail Marys. Where's my kick? What? I can't do anything. It's too laggy. It's insane. It's absolutely insane lag. What the fuck? It's completely bullshit. I'm hitting him, and then the game... Oh, no, he did Hurricane out of it. No, he didn't. I was hitting him. Where's my kick? What the fuck? Oh my god! There's nothing I can do because the lat dude, forget it. And this guy's platinum ranked. It's impossible to play him. It's literally impossible. He just keeps throwing out random fucking hurricane, hurricane, hurricane. And you can't do anything about it because you can't see them, so you can't counter hit them. The guy's a fucking asshole. The guy's literally a piece of shit. His connection is so bad. It's it's really not fun. It's unplayable. How am I supposed to ever win a match against him when this is all he's gonna do? This cheating ass bullshit. Throw out shit and lag. Throw out more shit and lag. You fucking suck, dude. <laughs> oh, look. I'm just gonna keep throwing out hurricanes over and over. I'm such a good player. What the fuck? I can't do anything. Look. I can't. It's dropping all my inputs. Look. <laughs> I literally can't do anything to him. What was that? I can't do anything. He literally just mashes attacks and light. They all go through my stuff. I can't do anything. I didn't do that. I did roll.
It's so, it's garbage gameplay. It's complete garbage gameplay. Nightblade, why don't you go fuck yourself, you dumb shit? Seriously, go suck a fucking dick somewhere, you nice asshole. You don't know anything about the fucking game, you're gonna talk shit to me. Wow! Wow, nothing comes out. What the fuck? What the fuck? Again? What? I can't do a flip? Yeah. I can't do a fucking flip. I can't do any of my moves. And whenever I go for a move, I get the wrong move. Either I go for charge, I get wall dive, or the other. I get one or the other. And then he just mashes out his fucking hurricane a million times, and I can't do anything about it. So this guy's platinum ranked, and literally, he's winning only because he purposely has a bad internet connection. Make no answer buts about it. He's doing that on purpose. He's literally cheating on purpose and then mashing <clears throat> in the lag out these ridiculous moves, abusing rollback netcode. That is the perfect example why, why rollback netcode is terrible and should not be used in fighting games. I don't give two fucks what person or fighting game player that's prominent in the fighting game community says rollback is good. It's not. It's shit. That is 100% the example of why scrub players get by mashing out laggy shit in that terrible fucking netcode. It should not be in any game at all. It shouldn't. It's terrible garbage. It shouldn't be allowed in any fucking fighting game. You shouldn't have characters taking back combos, mashing out reversal through everything you do, and oh, you never did anything. No, I did. I know exactly what the fuck I'm doing. And the game is a piece of shit because you use garbage netcode. But everyone wants to kiss its ass. It's not good, okay? It's not. It, uh, it's complete abuse. It leads to massive online abuse. Well, now we can't play this guy. This is the same fucking guy from before, by the way. He's been Kuma. Fucking ridiculous nonsense, man. Can't even have fun. Just trying to have fucking fun with the game. You can't have fun with it because people are just out outright abusing it. Outright fucking abuse of the game. No, by the way, Hyper Fighting Ryu is not that good. He's decent. I'd say probably high mid tier in Hyper in uh, Hyper Street Fighter 2, but he's not top tier. He's only top tier if you can mash Hurricane in any situation because the netcode is trash. It's like this. All right. Allow me to ask you a question. In real life, okay, a tense moment's about to happen, okay? Maybe you're driving your car and it looks like another car is coming straight for you. Which would you prefer to happen? All of a sudden, everything around you slows down in slow-mo and you have to try to react to it in slow-mo, all right? Or would you prefer if everything just skips ahead and rewinds and skips ahead again? In slow-mo, yeah, it's slow, but at least you can try to react to it. In fucking jumping ahead and then skipping around? You can't react to shit. It, you might be dead. You don't even know it yet because the game re rewinds and then fast forward again. You see what I'm saying? Like, just logically, what idiot would want a situation in life where you want things to happen, then reset and happen again? No, never would I want that ever. The whole idea of rollback is insanely stupid and an, only a fucking idiot would like that. I can't believe so many fucking people in competitive fighting games think it's good. How dumb? I, I seriously justify it. How can you fucking justify it? I never hear any justification for why it's good either. It's just, oh, it's just better. Really? Why? Explain. Oh, fuck. I got him. Final time to bust. on the wall. Oh my god! Whoa, whoa, whoa! What? <laughs> twice the game dropped my input. Oh, I'll win this way. It dropped my input twice. I couldn't finish the round. 
Okay. Like I don't, I don't care what other fighting game pros say. Here's what I know how how rollback netcode started. One of the Cannon brothers, one of the people running Evo and who used to run Sharyuken.com, they coded it. They told literally everyone, here it is, use it for free. We are online emulation like MAME and shit. And once you use it, tell us how it looks. And everyone said, it looks good because you don't see slow-mo. And everyone hated when games lagged online, everything would be running in slow-mo. It appears to be running full speed. It's not, it's skipping all around, it's taking shit back. It's terrible, it's not good for competition. But it looked pretty. So the Canon brother who wrote it literally told everyone to kiss his ass and put up a bunch of testimonials on Shoryuken.com about how good it is, so that way they could sell it to Capcom. And anyone who was honest about it saying, actually, it's not that good, it's dropping a ton of inputs, it's jumping all around, they would fucking delete their comments and, or ban them from the site. They banned me from the site for it. And when I asked them why was I banned, they said, because we're trying to make money and you're preventing us from making a, a buck on this netco. I said, so why, aren't you, why don't you just be honest about it instead of completely trying to make only positive testimonials and lying about it, all right? So what happened over the years, all right, everyone got brainwashed into thinking it was the best netcode because the canon set it up that way. Essentially, you had to agree with that. If you didn't, you'd be in trouble in the community. Oh, how dare you say it's not the best netcode? How dare you even suggest better netcode? Everyone knows rollback's the best. We want that rollback, right? It became a fucking meme, really. A, a meme, you must like rollback netcode. And I'm sorry, it was just never good. It never was desirable to me. I would rather be in fucking slow motion than have it jump forward, show something that didn't happen, and then take it back. Or even worse, like you saw with that laggy dude. I'm just gonna keep mashing Hurricane Kick, and because the game is guessing what's going on, it's gonna guess nine times out of 10 that the Hurricane Kick Kick was timed correctly for perfect reversal, which means it has iframes and passes through everything, okay? I'm just tired of the shit. I'm tired of people kissing ass. I'm tired of people fucking allowing things to just get a pass. The rollback netcode is shit. It always was. Fucking grow up and fucking admit it instead of kissing dick all fucking day. The kids don't even fucking run Evo anymore. Why are we fucking kissing their asses? I don't, I don't get it. It'll be one thing. Oh, okay, they run the Nationals. If we talk shit, we'll get in trouble with the Nationals. Uh, fuck them. <laughs> I don't give a fuck about them. Why do you think I'm, the, I'm literally the only one who says it? Why do you think? I'm the only one who doesn't care. Are we going to do blacklist me for the community? I'm not in the community. I don't enter tournaments, you can't ban me! <laughs> ah, interrupted my crap. Nope. Caught me. I tried to do an air throw there. No, you know what it is? So back in the day, why do you think, guys? I mean, let's be honest here. Why do you think the mainstream fighting community never liked me? Right now. This is why. Because I was the one who would speak up. I was the one who would be honest. I was the one who would be like, nah, I'm not going to fucking lie to everyone about it. I'm going to tell you the truth. And no one liked that. They're like, oh, you're not a butt kisser. You're not in the in crowd. You know what I mean? That's exactly why. This is why I was. everyone hated me from SRK and from fucking run, people who ran Evo. There was a few people who liked me because I was the, the person who was the guy who spoke out, who was the guy who was honest. When I ran a tournament, there was zero favoritism. There was zero cheating. There was none of that shit. I was the guy who was the honest guy who ran a tournament, you know? Holy Warrior says, you sound salty over it. How long was it? You want to know why I'm salty? Because we're still using rollback netcode. If we had better netcode right now, why would I even be talking about it? It's 20 fucking 22. And we're still using this broken ass netcode because everyone is a fucking idiot and kissed SRK ass for so long that they all still somehow believe this is the best netcode. 
you're watching examples of how it's bad. The dude literally hurricane kick, hurricane kick, hurricane kick. Oh, look, hurricane kick, hurricane kick. And the game gives him the advantage every time. I time my moves. My moves don't come out. He just bashes hurricane and land. How is that viable netcode exactly? Why are we not demanding or at least asking for something more? Instead, we just want rollback because we believe it's the best. It's not. We could have so much better, but everyone just wants to accept that it's good. <clears throat> huh. I've played this guy a bunch, Alien Hominid. I remember that name is, is familiar to me. Wonder McThunder, the people reason call me salty is because, as you see, I'm passionate about things. There's certain things in my life that, you know, uh, repeated abuse of shit, people being mistreated, things that go by, and I don't, I don't let that shit go. I don't, you know? I still, to this day, I feel like people are being rewarded for fucked up things that they did a hundred years ago and that it's not fair how, how things have turned out for certain people and, and certain parts of the community. I can't believe we're using rollback netcode in 2022. I can't. I can't believe people think it's good. They've had the wool pulled over their eyes to think it's good. It's fucking shit. But they're, you know, they don't know any better. When everyone who's a big prominent person in the, in the fighting community says it's good, of course you're gonna think it's good. You're not gonna know better. You're not gonna understand why it's not good. Why the fuck would you want AI to guess and determine what is gonna happen in the fighting game? AI? You want a fucking AI to tell me what I did, right and wrong? I didn't want that, I wanted the other super. That's the wrong move. Oh, I didn't count. Oh, I don't have this level two. Oh. oh, I didn't even know what happened there. I was, I was seeing if I could cancel that into another move, and I dashed right into the fucking shooter. Got owned. <laughs> Got owned. Yeah. I don't know Morgan so well, so I'm getting owned here. Super can! Oh yes! Super combo! Beautiful! Got the combo. Alright, it's one on one now. I can't get my fucking jab to come out. I keep getting heavy punch. I don't want that. Wow, I'm gonna blow. What? Oh, she threw me. Yeah, super beautiful. Oh no, I'm dizzy. I'm done. She got me. She caught me. Oh, I got out of it. How the hell? Oh no, it's a grapple. Oh, <laughs> it's a grapple super. Oh no. I had it. I blew it. All I had to do was a super there. Seriously, all I had to do was a super and I won. I fucking stood there like an idiot. Oh my god. Ah! I blew it. I totally blew it. <laughs> yeah, that was great. Oh my god. Oh, all right. Let's do... I'm gonna... Okay, I'm gonna my best character Zangief, so let's go to Zangief. Oh god! What a dropped input that was.
That spinning clothesline is so good. out of her own super. Punish me full screen. I didn't know that. You can punish the spinning clothesline full screen to super. <laughs> Not what I did. I can't get my move to come out now. Sucks. Nice. Final atomic boss. Can take it all back. Nice. Should be enough of a tiny bit left, I think. Yep. Got her! <laughs> Got her with the low kick. Good fight. Good fight. Good fight. I should rename this the Gem Fighter stream. I mean, this is what happens every week: is we get a bunch of one game, and then a bunch of another game, and then a bunch of another. So we started off with a bunch of Vampire Savior, then we went to, to Street Fighter 2, and now it's a bunch of Gem Fighter. It comes in like clusters, right? Okay. By the way, thank you, Crunchiest Onion, for that tip. I will shout that out, you know, once we finish this set. So good in this. Spinning pile driver, beautiful. Beautiful. She wasn't expecting it because I haven't used it in so long. Punish, watch, punish it every time. Smart. Smart. Again! Boom! Oh my god! Combo. Combo. Oh my god, completely dominated by the splash. You beat everything. <clears throat> Damn, good shit. Woo! Rugal says, yes, gift of gifts delivered successfully. So the crunchiest onion took the dollar fifty and says. So, if the Cannon Brothers aren't around anymore, it's actually not true. They're actually developing that, um, that fucking League of Legends fighting game, if you can believe it. They're making it, okay? If they don't run EVO anymore, also not really true. They sold EVO to Sony, but supposedly, behind the scenes, they still have a lot of influence and are involved with the running of it. Although, technically, they don't own it and don't have ultimate control anymore, okay? Then why do people still praise rollback netcode? Is it habit or are they kissing someone else's ass? All right, it's it's pretty simple. Uh, it's actually a pretty simple premise here. Take a look at the example of Street Fighter V for your proof. Street Fighter V, it came out and everyone said it was great. I said it was okay. After a few months, I hated it. 
right? Everyone said, oh, it's so good, it's so good. Then all of a sudden, people start deciding, oh, wait a minute. Um, it's actually not that good. There's too much input delay. So then they patch it to fix that, and then people, okay, we love it. And they kissed its ass for how many years, right? The whole time they kissed his ass, I said, I don't think it's good. It's not as good as all the other Street Fighters, right? I was the one who publicly said that, while everyone else was usually kissing its ass. All of a sudden, earlier this year, they announced, that's it. No more content for Street Fighter V. It's done now. Now we're going to work on Street Fighter VI. All of a sudden, Street Fighter VI info starts coming out, right? Promotion for it. What starts happening? Oh, players start coming out. Yeah, Street Fighter V wasn't that good. Daigo comes out. Oh, I really didn't like it. I didn't think it was very good. Where the fuck were you for the five, six years that everyone was playing it, right? Where was everyone being, where, why was no one honest when the game was prominent? And the answer is very simple. Until there is a replacement for something, people in the fighting game community are fucking terrified to criticize what's there because they're so afraid that if people drop what's there to play, they will have nothing. They're afraid their community will die if they don't have something to currently focus on. So even though Street Fighter V isn't very good, they're going to say it's great. They're going to play the shit out of it. They're going to go to tournaments. They're going to stream it. They're going to do everything. Because without that, what else did they have? Did they have a single Capcom fighting game to play? No. So it's Street Fighter V or nothing. Promote the nothing. You see, or excuse me, promote the Street Fighter V. Don't drop it and have nothing. You see? Right now, what do you have? Laggy netcode or rollback netcode? They both suck. So are they going to be honest and be like, well, the rollback netcode is actually shitty. We should, we should, no. Just kiss the rollback netcode's ass until better netcode comes out. Then all of a sudden they'll all say, you know, rollback netcode actually wasn't that good. But they don't want to admit that. They want to fool the masses into thinking the game is good, the netcode's good, because they want it to become mainstream popular so that they can become prominent. That's all it is. They, they're so deathly afraid their community will die if they don't kiss butt and say that this stuff is good. Okay. Um, <clears throat> this is no sleep real vibes, by the way. Oh, this is the lag. <laughs> it's lag. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go with Sasquatch. I've been enjoying playing with Sasquatch tonight. Oh, here we go. I think he has super armor when you do that, like you can't ground him because he's on the creature. In the middle of a crown ball, he gets it. Oh! Finally got a full combo. <laughs> Whew. That's that's tricky. That dark forces where he rides the uh the creature. Because he doesn't ever get grounded, so you have to keep hitting him and it does chunks of damage, but he can't ever be interrupted. I know, slow mo music, you can hear the connection breaking down. I'm getting slow mo music. <laughs> I think one day there will be a replacement for rollback netcode that will be better. And then literally what I just said will happen. Everyone will admit it. Ah, you know, well, all those years that we were crazy rollback actually wasn't that good, but we didn't have anything better. So we, instead of demanding better or being honest about it, we kind of had to kick, it, kick his butt. Well, I'm sorry that I'm honest and I tell it like it is. And I know it's not good. Some people just can't handle that shit. Uh-oh. Ooh, big foot. <laughs> big booty. Oh god, the lag. Are you serious? He jumped over it. Oh, he had 360 there.
What was for dinner? We had a rigatoni pasta with a spicy marinara sauce and chicken uh, meatballs Italian style. Can you do ice garbage with the 720 sled super? Maybe. I don't know how to do the 720 sled super. How do you do it? <laughs> I don't know. How do you do that? I don't even know about that. I don't. I don't use it. Yeah. Hello, Cheerio Eater. How are you? No, we haven't had we haven't had homemade sauce in a very very long time. We have not done homemade sauce in a long time because as I told you guys, when we make the homemade sauce, it's a whole day project to do it. It takes about an hour and a half to two hours of prep, then it has to simmer all day, and to get all the ingredients, unless you go to certain stores, some of them can be really pricey. So we have to go around to certain places to get the ingredients for the sauce. We just haven't done that. We haven't even really gone out in, in a long time. We haven't had money. We haven't had the means. You know, we, we just kind of, on the day off, most days we just stay home now and I go out and run errands. There's been a long time since we actually like, had a day out, out, except unless we need to, like, to get our hair cut or something, so. Yeah, no sleep real vibes. When you do, when you activate that dark forces or whatever it's called and you're riding the sea creature, you can't block, right? You're, it's basically unblockable. Like, you can keep hitting, but you can't block. I think you have infinite super armor, which is what I'm trying to take advantage of there. I'm trying to get a bunch of hits and then you can't avoid do giant chunks of damage. Slayer says, I'm currently watching Yakuza 7 playthrough. Oh, my playthrough. And uh, I wish it was when you were doing interactive. Yeah, it wasn't. That was before 20, 2017. It was 2017 is when I changed it up. And I became an interactive content creator and streamer, and I talked to people constantly. Yeah, it was a totally different formula from 2008 all the way through 2017. So nine freaking years I did different content. What's the sauce recipe? It's my, my family's recipe of marinara sauce. It uses all kinds of stuff. on tomatoes, garlic, onion, a ton of seasoning, slow simmering all day. It's, I can't just explain it to you simply. It's not a simple sauce. Has a, it has a pork fat base, actually. Oh, here we go. We got Shenko. All right, you know what? I've been playing Sasquatch all night. Just for the sake of consistency this week, I will pick Sasquatch. I can already tell you it's laggy. Look how laggy it is. Dude, it's insanely laggy. What? I was in the middle of hitting her and the game took it back and gave her a throw. Dude, I can't do anything. It's too laggy. I can't see the attacks. Yeah, it's impossible to play. Oh, this is great netcode, right? Oh, yeah, this is great rollback netcode. Isn't this outstanding? I can't even see the attacks. How is, it, how is this playable netcode exactly? How is this playable netcode? It doesn't show the frames of animation that are hitting me. It just shows endless attacks hitting me. I can't do anything about it. And this is a gold-ranked player? No, you're a fucking asshole. You have a terrible connection. You're not a good player. Why is it every person with a high rank in this collection has a terrible internet connection? Yet, yeah, rollback netcode's good, guys. You have to be a fucking idiot to say that. You have to be a fucking moron to say rollback netcode is good and then look at that. Gold rank and none of the animations come out to hit me. Like, what the fuck is your problem, man? Well, I mean, what do I even do? Here, I'll try QB. I'm probably not going to get a single hit in. This is a joke. 
What was that? I didn't mean for that. I couldn't even move. I can't, I can't do anything. She does that, it's a free hit. I can't even get out of the way. What? I was attacking her with a ground combo. The game gave her a combo instead. Again, why does she get a combo? I'm attacking her. What the fuck? I'm not doing anything. <laughs> Only the best fucking net go, guys. Can't do anything. Every time she does the hanging move, I have no ability to dodge it or do anything. It just gives her a free combo after. How am I dizzy? I don't even know what happened. Again, I can't see it. Can't block. She a free combo. I can't do anything. <laughs> what a waste of time. Dude, this game is a, it's a waste of time because of the Neko. I seriously can't believe that. What, do, what am I supposed to do when you can't see the attacks? You literally can't see the attacks hitting you. It's just skip half of the frames of animation. Wow, what a great game. This is really top level gameplay, right? So I'm not gonna win. I'll just pick fucking Sasquatch again. And I'm gonna lose. There's no way I can even hit the opponent because it takes everything back. It shows me doing a combo. The game takes the combo back and she gets a full combo. Can't block I can't block anything. I can't do anything. I can't move. Can't block, can't move, and can't block. Can't look, she just do the same thing over and over. No timing, no skill, just match, match the moving lag. <laughs> it showed one move, then said, oh, she never did that move. She did a super instead and showed the super instead and it hits me. Wow. Roll back. Roll back. I love the roll back. But totally it wouldn't have been like better if it was in slow-mo. No, instead I just like to continuously get hit by moves that aren't on the screen. That's better than, you know, slow-mo. Okay. Okay, whatever you say. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Yeah, just before, huh, Slayer? Yeah, my Yak Yakuza Zero. It was January 2017, so just before it was February that I became interactive. When I, well, I remember, it was when I, uh, I completely changed it up. It was uh, Zelda, Breath of the Wild. I remember. <clears throat> the solution is to drop rollback netcode. That's the solution. Literally, all it does it promotes people to purposely play with bad internet. That guy, the reason that it skipped like that is because he's doing shit to his internet to make it run like that. And he knows if he just did the same pattern over and over, I can't even see it. So he's found a, a lag abuse. The same thing with that fucking bison player that I was playing earlier, the CE bison. He would do torpedo, I would punish it by throwing him. I go to walk behind him and hit, the game just skips all of it and gives him a throw. And he knows because he's purposely making his internet worse. He's, he's allowing it to happen. Like, it's fucked up. These people are just try-hard scumbags, and they do it on purpose. Like, they care that the fucking ranking online means anything. It doesn't mean anything. You're a loser if you do it. And they're literally everyone who has platinum gold is doing it. Look, at every connection at platinum and gold is that level. They're, how many good matches have I had that were platinum and gold, honestly? Maybe two? It's very rare. They're all just cheaters. And this is in every fucking game. 
but somehow we still say that this net code is good. I, I'm at a loss. Mm. What made me so long before I became an interactive streamer? Because remember, before I ever streamed, I was a YouTuber and I was just an on-demand video guy. I didn't stream or anything. Streaming wasn't prominent when I started in 2008. So for me, it was always about making that on-demand playthrough. I started in 2008 all the way through 2013. I didn't even do direct capture. So, you know, four or five years, that was my deal. That was what people came to my channel for. Um, and because of that, when I adopted streaming, I was afraid to change my formula. I was thinking, if I change my formula, I'm going to isolate all those people who supported me for all those years, who come to watch a certain style of content on my channel. And so I adopted streaming and direct capture, but what I ended up doing was um, pretending like no one was there. I pretended like I didn't even have a live audience. And instead, I was just kind of like talking to the on-demand audience, which was really, really fucking stupid. Seriously, it was really dumb. Um, I absolutely should have had an interactive audience and treated it as such, but I was dumb. I, you know, if I had done it in 2013, I'd probably be way ahead of the curve right now. But I was stubborn. I didn't realize. I didn't see the changes coming. I didn't see the writing on the wall, as they say. You know what I mean? Oh, let's see. How about some Dalsim? I haven't played with Dalsim in a while now. Locked down in the corner. No, my old camera I used to use for playthroughs doesn't work anymore. It broke. Uh oh. Heave ho! The heave ho throw. Very nice. Damn, that guy's ultra gold. <laughs> ultra gold. <clears throat> I'm just gonna pick him again. Honda, counter pick. Beautiful. <laughs> A beautiful counter selection. How nice. I couldn't block. He did full screen super. It wouldn't allow me to block it. And then he just matches punches and wins. What a great game. Can't do anything. Can't, I can't block. Literally, he's just mashing in, in lag. Look what he did. Headbutt, mash hands. Headbutt, mash hands in lag. I can't block anything he does. <laughs> what a great player. Ultra gold. That's the ultra gold level of player in this game. Okay. All right, bro. And it, then he refuses to rematch because he knows he's a pussy bitch and I, I'll play the shit out of him. He's a fucking lag masher. Literally, everyone with a high ranking in this game is terrible. They're all terrible players. They're literally all terrible plays. That's a hilarious joke. I beat the shit out of his bison. He fucking counterpicks me, mashes in lag, and then quits. <laughs> Unreal. <clears throat> Disco Turkey, shut the fuck up. Really, shut the fuck up, you stupid idiot. You're bad sport. What do you mean a sport? He literally cheated to win and then ran like a bitch. There's no bad sport. You're just a fucking dumb fuck. So shut up. <clears throat> tired of taking abuse from idiots you're gonna come on here and try to fuck shit to me like i haven't been fucking playing this game for 25 years get the fuck out of here 
It's this guy again. Yay. It's the lag abuser. Actually, last time he didn't ready up either, did he? So he's not even at his fucking, uh, his console. He's just being stupid. No, he won't play. What he's gonna do, he's gonna keep searching. When he sees me, he's just gonna time it out. He's trying to annoy me, because he knows that he's a bitch. <laughs> he knows he's a lag abuser, so. Here we go! I get to play him! Oh, boy. He didn't, wait a minute, why didn't he run? Why didn't he run to, uh, he should have ran to fucking Akuma again. Oh my god! I can't jump forward. That was super, which would have hit him fully if it came out. do anything because of lag. You saw it skip the animation. It didn't show any animation for me to block it. It just gave him a hit. I can't do anything. I'm blocked in place. Unbelievable. Lag of you. <sighs> he picked DJ. <laughs> he went to DJ. Why would you do that? He wants to do a DJ mirror match. Good for you. his punch and gets a random throw from maximum distance, which makes no sense. Bullshit, he didn't deserve to lose that one. That one, I'll say, you can tell his moves weren't coming out either because of the net code, and he did not deserve to lose at all. And that was a bullshit ending. He shouldn't even got hit by that. So, now I will call bullshit when I see it. I didn't deserve that win. That was the game being fucking stupid, and that's not fair that he lost that fight.
I lose because there was a lag spike. You saw it. I did super, the game lagged, and then the super came out late, and I didn't get my juggle. That's definitely what I did. No super. I can't even get a fucking move. Look at this. I can't get a move. Where's my kick? Oh my god, fuck this. I can't get any fucking moves to come out at all for the second half of the fucking round. I have him clean with the jumping roundhouse. No jumping roundhouse comes out whatsoever. It just drops my input completely. This game is fucking laggy fucking bullshit. The game is terrible with this netcode. Rollback netcode sucks. Unbelievable. My favorites is, again, being in the middle of combos, being in the middle of tactics that are working, my move drops. Oh, he mashes and the game consists out of 50-50, oh, he threw you instead. What are you talking about? It's fucking shit. Slayer, I think I started being interactive on my streams around late February. I want to say late February uh, 2017 during the Zelda Breath of the Wild playthrough, so... I don't know if you want to look at, like, the second half of the Aquas 7 playthrough and see if I changed or not. At that point, I'm not sure. <clears throat> I'm pretty sure we played this game with this guy already. Yeah. <sighs> Wow, where's my answer? Oh, that was an overhead? I didn't even know you could do that. Oh, wow. Yeah, you could alternate into an overhead during his combo strength. I didn't know that. Should have got hit by that. Oh shit. What the fuck? Did you see that I passed through like twice? Oh wow, don't go to Oh shit, man. Oh no, good toss! That was a good one. So close, I got him. That was so close. That was the game. Oh shit, I didn't even realize that was the second round. No, no sleep real vibes. The developers are not gonna tweak this game. I hate to say they're just not going to. There's not enough of a player base for it. I don't think a lot of people bought it, honestly. With as little of a player base that I'm seeing there is, I really don't think that they're gonna bother ever improving it. It's gonna be another Street Fighter 30th anniversary collection all over again. Thank you, Lord Prince Albert, for the super chat. I appreciate that. Oh, shit. Fight him. Floss with his non existent chest hair. <laughs>
Yes, perfect. Drop my move. I didn't do anything. I just tried to block. Nice, I got a punish. Nice move. Oh, got me. Perfect wake up. Tried the bait, punished me. God damn it. Nah, oh my god, so much damage. Is that what I wanted? Whoa. Got him! No, it interrupted! I can't believe it! Full speed super! I got him! I beat him with the full speed super. Damn. Close ending. Oh, what's up, Derek? Yes, it's the new Street Fighter shirt. Yes, don't need to buy a fan. <laughs> I'll have another new shirt for tomorrow as well. Thank you, LeBron, for the super chase. Thank you for the stream. I appreciate it. All right, last match, guys. Oh, excuse me. Last match of the night right now. Sorry for so much gem fighter. What are you going to do? <laughs> I got to play what's available. That was 360. Yeah. Oh, I hate that. I'm trying to punish and it fucking interrupts. Whoa. Why oh, jumped into it? The gems level up your special moves. They do not give you super. Super meter is attained by hitting the opponent or attacking. While the gems make your special moves level up and have better properties and more damage, too. Ah. Got him! Nice. Final atomic buster. Ow. I think that's it. I just won. He was not expecting the final time of Buster. Uh, damn. All right, Derek, have a good night. I'll see you in the marathon tomorrow. Sounds good. That was, that's right, Ro Rugal. The final gift of Geef delivered tonight. Thank you, guys. Again, I, I apologize for ranting and raving about the netcode. We all know... We all know the deal, and you know, you guys know I'm honest. I'm gonna call it out when I see it. <clears throat> if those people were not abusing the netcode, I wouldn't have to complain about it. They blatantly abuse it. They blatantly get away with it because the netcode is shit, and everyone, oh, oh yeah, rollback is so good. It's the best. It's not. It's just as bad. All it is is this little pretty. When the rollback netcode is running properly and they're not abusing it, it actually looks nice. But as soon as people say, oh, it's rollback netcode, I know what to do. Let me fuck up my internet, make it low quality, and watch this. Watch me teleport and get free combos and shit. 
shit. Anyway, thank you guys for a fun stream. Thanks to everyone who was here and chilled and supported in any way. I would say Super Chats and Tips were, were decent tonight, and I appreciate that very much. Uh, until next week, same time, same place, guys. Thank you.